I'm Steve Mortimer from Australian Shuffleboard. I'm pleased to announce the relaunch of this special indoor sporting recreation. Now let's go back in time to see the enjoyment of our senior citizens playing shuffleboard. Well in sport there's a lot to be said for youthful enthusiasm but when it really counts you can't put an old head on young shoulders. That was certainly the case at the finals of the Inter-Village Shuffleboard Championships where Peter Fitzsimons discovered the fountain of youth. Like the sign says, there are no senior citizens here, just recycled teenagers. Do this. Go do it. Oh, well, luck. The man doing all the shouting is Steve Mortimer, recycled himself from that great cover defender for the Bulldogs into a promoter of the game of shuffleboard in pubs and now retirement villages. Is it a game better suited to the pubs or retirement homes? Well, I thought so. For pubs and clubs, it's a bit of fun. But a village up in Queensland approached me and we sold a table to them. And when I went up there and I saw the happiness on their faces, there were people that never came out of their rooms before who were getting on the shuffleboard and, and competing and playing. I thought, this is definitely the, ma the market to go in. The rules are similar to lawn bowls. The aim is to put your puck close to the end of the table. Now, on each end, okay, only one team can receive the points. So the aim is to either improve your own position or knock your opponent off the table. Thus... Look at this, look at this. Great shot. Two, if a puck two, actually three, hangs off the end of the table, you get a bonus point. And the crowd goes crazy. Casey pulls off a miracle shot, knocking off the Irvine puck. Irvine fight back, but Moina is running hot. When you reach the twilight years, it's time to relax, settle down, and take it easy. Not! That rowdy bunch in there are living proof that fun has no age limit. For an 80-year-old, fun is a game called a shuffleboard. Sport is one of our greatest mediums in life and this now, when people like can't bend anymore or on a walker or a wheelchair, it restricts them what they can do. Shoot and shuffle allows them to participate in a sport, teams playing each other, uh, meeting new people, making new friends giving them quality of life. There's nothing like shuffleboard for developing greed, meanness, toughness. I have seen people turned avaricious because of shuffleboard. These days, Mortimer okay, plays crown jester in a new game called shuffleboard. One never quite it. It's a fast track, this will get them. It's uh, sort of made me feel younger, I think, too, today. It's made me feel as though, well, life's still well worth living, isn't it? Instead of having to just sit around and, and read books or watch television or something, you know, we've got something else we can do. The shuffleboard is just like when I played rugby league. It's sport. It brings about all the positives in sports. That's competition, self-esteem, social interaction. You meet new people, make new friends. Competition is healthy. Even some people that don't want to compete will want to come along and watch. That's the interaction. So competition and interaction go hand in hand. And I think that is damn healthy no matter how old you are. In this country's senior citizens a chance to relive the thrill of competitive sport. Rugby league fans have always admired the skills of Steve Mortimer whenever he was playing for his club Canterbury, State New South Wales or Australia. Since his retirement, Mortimer hasn't been idle developing a version of a 400-year-old game called Shuffleboard. 
The sport, which originated in the United Kingdom, has become a hit amongst the elderly, who can easily relate to its rules. We enjoy doing it, yes, it's much like bowls. It's getting a lot of people activated. The game is played at hip height, where players slide pucks down the table, and the first person, or team to 15 points, wins. This game is ideally suited for age and rehabilitative care. It's a game where people become more frail and little things they can do, but they can play shuffleboard, so it, it brings all the good positives of sport. The interaction, the competition, the cheering like you can hear now, that's a great thing for our old Australians.